Hello, boys and girls. It's Mrs. Pecora here, back to read you another story. So today's story we're going to be reading is called Maybe You Should Fly a Jet, Maybe You Should Be a Vet. And boys and girls, it's written by, Do by Theo Lesigue, and we know him as Dr. Seuss. It is illustrated by Michael Smolin. So sit back, relax, and enjoy today's story. Want to be a ticket taker? Want to be a pizza maker? Lobster man, jockey, TV fixer, ballet dancer, soda mixer. Do you want to be an astronaut or keeper of the zoo? You've got to do something. What do you want to do? Taylor, sailor, nailer, jailer. You've got to be someone sooner or later. How about a wrestler, a writer, or a waiter? How about a dentist? How about a florist? How about a forester working in a forest? Do you wish to be an oil refiner, diamond miner, dress designer? How about a paper hanger? How about a bass drum banger? Do you want to do your work outdoors? Do you want to work inside? Would you like to be a plumber, a policeman, or a bride? Would you rather work in a mountain town or in the desert lower down? Pet shop owner, money loaner. How about a slide tromboner? How about a perfume smeller? How about a fortune teller? You could be a turkey farmer. You could be a teacher. You could be a lot of things. How about a preacher? You could be a clown or a coffee perker. How about an iron worker? Fireman, tireman, telephone wireman. Some girls make good picture framers. Some girls make good lion tamers. Some guys make good tightrope walkers. Other guys are better talkers. Maybe you should fly a jet. Maybe you should be a vet. How about a deep sea diver? How about a beehive hiver? Would you like to be an actor? Would you like to run a tractor? Like to drive a taxi cab or run a big computer lab? Tennis pro, optometrist, hockey pro, podiatrist, chemist, lepidopterist. Glass blower, mushroom grower, how about a fishbone boner or a roller coaster owner? Would you sooner be a ballooner or a grand piano tuner? Olympic champion, mountain guide, it's not easy to decide. You've got to be someone. You can't just be a doodler. You could be a sculptor or perhaps a noodle noodler. You might be a mystery guy. Would you like to be a spy? Maybe you should be a vester a jester, or a hammock tester. Maybe you should be a voice. Someday you must make a choice. Maybe you should be a voice. When you find out what a voice is, you can tell us what your choice is. Boys and girls, I hope you enjoyed this story. Sorry you hear my puppy Winston barking there. I think he's barking at a squirrel. But anyway, stay tuned for another great story. Have a great day.